Hello data lovers. So Python has become the language of the data. And when I say this, I'm pretty sure you and I both agree on this topic. So it doesn't matter who you are. If you are an aspiring data professional, be it data engineer, data scientist or data analyst, ML engineer, any data related job profile, then you will be using Python as a programming language in your day to day activities for sure. And the main reason that Python has a such huge fan following in the data domain. So it is definitely easy to use. You can quickly learn it and it's humongous support for enriching data analytics libraries, which makes it a perfect choice for any data professional to kickstart their career. But the main problem, if someone is coming from the non-coding background, then they find it very difficult on the logic building part and the problem solving part. Also, how to use this programming language and especially talking about my interview experience for past two, three years in good top tech companies, including Meta, Uber, Grab, Amazon, Flipkart and many more. So these type of companies will definitely ask easy to medium type of DSA questions and their preferred choice will be Python again. And to help you guys to be proficient with Python programming, including the DSA and how to use data libraries practically on real world data set, how to use it and how to implement them in the project. We have launched our most exciting Python bootcamp for DSA and data libraries. As similar to our previous bootcamps, here you will be also getting it in the form of live classes so that you can learn along with the mentor. And the most interesting thing about this bootcamp that the duration will be just 1.5 months and everything will be taught from the very basic. So even if you do not have any prior experience with the programming, this is the right bootcamp for you to kickstart your journey. And as I said, we believe more in the practical learnings. So all the DSA questions you will be solving practically in the live classes. Also the implementation of the data libraries like pandas, numpy, matplotlib, and many other interesting data libraries. You will be doing all those hands-on on the real world data set. And to make this bootcamp more and more practical, to validate your learnings, you will be working on two to three industry level projects so that you can apply your Python knowledge and how well you can use the data libraries. So this is the launch video for our most interesting Python bootcamp and enrollments are open now. You can enroll in this bootcamp right now. Seats will be very limited because I know many people want to learn everything related to Python, but we can accommodate only limited number of people. So registrations have started. All the details have been provided in the description. Registration link is in the description and it's a special launch video. So we are running the mega launch offer as well. You can use the coupon code launch 55 and you will get exclusive amazing 55% discount on this bootcamp. And in case you have any query, any doubt related to anything, even including the career guidance, then you can use the new feature on our website, which is get a call and you can share your query for the selective bootcamp or even in general query and our career Career counselor will reach out to you to resolve all your queries and to give you the right direction. So one question you can ask me directly that how grow data skill is going to make this bootcamp super effective for all their learners. So few things which I want to emphasize and this is what our existing learners are actually enjoying in our bootcamps. The doubt support just after the live classes. So after the live classes, there will be a dedicated one hour doubt session with the mentor itself. So you can ask any queries and after that, there will be a dedicated Discord server community for all the enrolled people in that batch. So you can put your queries there and there will be a continuous chat doubt support as well. And you can make good friends within that community. You can learn from each other. So this is how we are actually making things very interesting. And apart from teaching, I know how important it is the job hunting part. So at the end of this bootcamp, we will be dedicatedly helping you on the resume building part, how to get all those job opportunities, how to prepare your effective LinkedIn profile, how to expand your network so that you can reach out to different people for different job opportunities, how to effectively use the job hunting platforms like Nokri, Indeed, Hiris and many more. So this is what we will be helping you throughout this bootcamp. So why are you waiting now? Because now you know the importance of the Python and how easily you can learn it in just 1.5 months. So hurry up and enroll as soon as possible because all these seats will be filled very, very quickly. So now let's have a very raw and candid conversation with the instructor of this bootcamp. Shubhankit, who's actually working as a data scientist in Accenture AI and building really, really cool projects in the data science domain itself. So this is the main reason you are going to enjoy this bootcamp very, very much because I experienced mentor who is already working in the industry and actually working 
in the data science domain using python on day to day basis very regressively he will be sharing his practical experience he will be bringing his practical experience in this boot camp so it's time to meet your instructor and i will be asking some common question which you might be having regarding this boot camp and since he is the instructor of this boot camp and he will be able to answer all of your queries so stay tuned and listen all uh, these questions which i'm going to ask him so first of all shubankit uh, what's your motivation to start this python boot camp uh, especially for the data structures algorithm part and some of the data analytics libraries which you are going to cover uh sushant first of all thank you for inviting me and uh, you know the my biggest motivation for this particular boot camp is to remove the fear of coding see most of our professionals that are working out there in the data data science industry they have a fear of coding and they run away from coding and i have been there so you know i have no doubt in that right ki okay there's a fear of coding especially to people who are coming from a non coding background right mm-hmm. and you know that just not a you know it's just not a weakness also a limitation on your career right because you cannot learn uh, further things as well right so even if you are learning generative ai or llm which are advanced data science things you know you'll still have a fear of ki, okay how will i implement it right so you know and i face that fear so that is my biggest motivation to remove that bottleneck because then it just not opens the door for your initial job opportunity it will be a bigger thing for your further career as well right okay i have a comfortable i have comfort in coding out the logic that i'm building and you know that will be a great thing to learn the boot camp which you are going to start is it going to help anyone who is let's say preparing for d jobs data analyst jobs data science job or bi engineering so is it going to cover or you can say this will uh, be a one stop boot camp for cracking all these roles see python uh, i'm not exaggerating this but python is in 100% of a job description of any data science professional whether it be business analyst or data engineer or data analyst data scientist ml engineer doesn't matter right and the reason for that is you know that most of a uh, you know trending applications are built in python right and uh, you know it's like it has a larger community and if it has a larger community it has more inventions more inventions more libraries more libraries get included in the technology so it becomes a complete cycle right so i want people to be a part of that complete cycle and for that uh, you know it doesn't have to be any uh, prerequisite or something that they need to be really good in uh, you know they would be already working that's not a requirement here anybody from a college professional to person who has a gap or person who is uh, looking to switch into a data science industry or you know looking for a business analyst or a data analyst you know or moving even towards that they can offer this course what is the importance of the dsa and like to what extent we should focus on it uh, if if it is all about cracking the interviews because based on my personal experiences i have not seen it too much complicated like hard level uh, questions the way we get in the sds so how it is going to be in this boot camp are there couple of reasons for including ds in it so first of all uh, you know when i learned coding i didn't learn ds in initially but you know then uh, there was one incident where we built something and then we were trying to optimize the code right so we were dependent on some other person you know so then it became a two person job okay there is one data science professional who will build the algorithm and everything and there would be one sd or someone from the operations team as they say you know who will help us integrate that thing into the application right basically he'll optimize your code mm-hmm. right so first of all i wanted to remove that dependency right so that is a reason that you should learn dsa and the other thing is when you'll actually learn dsa you'll understand that coding is not a technology it's more an art yeah. right that uh, you know how do you structure it you can use one structure but why do, why should you use other structure right so you know just to get, adapt it properly it better to understand it in an artistic way and you know if you're going for a if you're planning for a big role right if you want to join a big organization a bigger uh, you know uh, product organization they'll ask you dsa mm-hmm. right doesn't matter you're coming from a data science professional background or you know they'll have to they'll you know or even if they don't ask you they'll uh, give you a plus point if you know dsa as well yeah. right so that is the reason for including ds in it and i think if you know person will do it so they'll remove the dependency from their self right okay now i am a complete resource for any organization so next question uh, shubankit let's say if someone from the non tech or non coding background then will it be difficult for them to learn python or uh, like it it would be easy because the kind of standard python has in the in the market and why am i including the non tech and non cs folks because we all know majority of them try to move into data science and the data analytics uh, domain so uh, shishank i'll 
just answer it in simple uh, words that the first thing that we i'll be covering in this course the first topic that i'll be covering in this course would be what is programming mm. right so i think that answers the question okay there's no uh, basic uh, skill required just a willingness to learn and uh, you know uh, you know motivation to learn coding right okay i'll have to remove this fear of coding and i want to build my career in this field right that is the only requirement for the course you will be teaching in this entire boot camp in the live classes so what is the reason to make it a live boot camp instead of the uh, recorded one how how do you differentiate it see i would say as a student what i have observed this is like my student observation that you know it's more immersive when you have a live lecture right uh, you know you can get your doubts cleared you can get uh, like there's some doubts that you won't have but the other person in the lecture might have right and then you can discuss over their doubt right so that's completely different thing and which is completely exclusive in the live lectures it's not something that is you know in the recorded lecture that is the one reason and also it builds uh, helps you builds a discipline right and once you'll have that learning discipline okay i can sit in for for 2 hours and you know uh, go through this lecture and obviously there would be recorded lecture for people who miss this but uh, you know it would be it will build discipline in you that will help you in longer term since it's a python boot camp when we say that like if we divide this boot camp itself so it's python plus dsa plus data analytics so what is the reason that you added the data analytics important libraries along with that some some project part as well the reason for that is uh, you know i suppose that major people who are opting for this course they want to transition or they want to move into the field of python and the best way to do it is to go via a data science route right so that is the reason that we are doing uh, you know a data science perspective of python right and also the projects are there to build the cv right so first of all the projects are industry projects you know they are we'll do it in in the same manner we do with projects in industry right so uh, that would be a really good thing because uh, the way you do projects in industry is very different from the way projects are being taught in other courses where you you know just have the data the fixed steps right like i really want people to struggle on the projects mm-hmm. right because more you struggle on the projects while doing it more easier it will be for you in the interviews right so that's the thing and also uh, as i said right that python has a bigger community right uh, and it if it has a bigger community they have a lot of analytical libraries like some of the python libraries like pandas numpy matplotlib they are directly listed in the job description mm. right so you know that gives the importance of them and like most of the work is being done in those libraries so it's you know it will be a good start for anyone who begin with python and like you will be directed to okay why i am learning python i want to learn those libraries i want to get the job now touching upon the uh, projects part uh, so bankit so will you teach these projects uh, from basic uh, uh, to the uh, advanced level i mean someone who wants to implement it and are completely new to the python so uh, how it is going to be for them yeah the project would be from basics and you know uh, it just start the coding part uh, while doing a project i'll also make sure you know the people understand the problem statement how do you form the problem statement you know many times working in the industry you'll have to form the problem statement right mm. and that's the biggest uh, you know ask right so this project would be completely uh, hands on they would be live right so it will not be like you know i'll give you some steps and you'll have to do that row you will be working along with me and uh, also not this project even the examples that we'll be using uh, while teaching you know while working any analytical library or Pyth- uh, python that is pandas or numpy any example mm. we'll uh, like i've included uh, you know industry examples only and even in the you know question here i have tried to include the industry examples only to mm-hmm. go from that perspective completely is it the boot camp which is for everyone we can say like open to all who are completely noob or new to the programming who all can join this boot camp as i said it's for anyone right uh, there's no limitation of it right okay, okay you have to be a working professional you have to be in this particular role or you have to do your you know graduation in this role mm-hmm. right i myself i am from non coding background right and uh, i work with some top tier data scientists who are from non coding background right so that has never been an issue uh, for me and i don't see it for anyone and also it would be a good start for someone who is uh, you know trying to figure out their position into it industry mm-hmm. you know sometimes as a fresh you don't know ki, okay should i which role should i go in so this role will take you uh, this particular course will take you from the scratch of coding you know and that will you know give you proper understanding okay whether i should opt for this career or not and uh, 
to be honest i think you should and uh, i'll make sure that after this course you will be a really good data science professional in this boot camp will you be helping us to prepare a good resume powerful strategies for job hunting and whatever uh, can be done for the students with respect to uh, get some opportunities and secure those job opportunities yeah, so that's an additional bonus thing in this bootcamp yeah. that you know i will be including a uh, proper portfolio optimization and resume uh, making things right and also include the linkedin optimization thing in the uh, you know course as well so you know because it's not just uh, i just don't want to you know give you some knowledge and not let you know what to do with it right so uh, we'll make sure you know that in the end you will have a good portfolio you have whatever you have learned this course uh, properly uh, you know visible in your portfolio and uh, let's see uh, i hope it takes you in great places so this is what i had to announce in this video and we are super super excited after launching this bootcamp and i am pretty sure you are also very excited if you are then use this opportunity link is in the description use the coupon code for the mega launch which is launch 55 and enroll in this bootcamp as soon as possible and we will see you in the live classes